Outdoors bound tonight, there's concern about a parasite that could pose problems for Virginia's world class trout management program. It's called trout guild lice and they've now been found here in Virginia. George Noliff of the Outdoors Bound team has been in touch with the Virginia Department of Wildlife Resources. He joins us now in studio. George, how big of a threat is this? Stoney, the short answer is we're still not sure, but it's something DWR is keeping a close eye on. How y'all doing folks? Virginia has one of the top trout management programs in the country. That's why this is such a big deal. Now here's what we know. Tiny parasites called trout gill lice have been found in rainbow trout in Blue Springs Creek in Smith County. The good news, if you can call it that, is that wildlife biologists think the species of gill lice found only infect rainbow trout and pose little threat to native brook trout. Tests are being done right now to confirm that. Now I'm told that rainbow trout can usually tolerate minor lice infections, but major infections can be life threatening. When rainbows are stocked in streams around the state, the DWR is still trying to find out where they came from, but the bigger issue is figuring out if these lice have spread and how to isolate them. So how can you spot them? Well, take a look at this close-up photo the DWR sent me of a trout's gills. Those little brown and white things there, those are gill lice. If you catch a trout, check the gills. If you see them, DWR wants to hear from you so Virginia can maintain its top shelf trout fisheries. George, do they present any threat to people? No, no. Oh, good. Um, they don't infect people. And if you catch a rainbow trout infected with these gill lice, they're safe to eat as long as you cook them properly. So that's the upside. That is some good news to hear. Thank you, George. We'll keep everyone posted when we get an update on that.